Hi everyone, this is Kudeep Sharma and uh, currently I am working here as Assistant Professor of Pharmacology in Gurgaon College of Pharmacy, Yamanaka. So in this particular today's session, we are going to demonstrate about the apparatus which is known as ectophotometer. So as we all know, this ectophotometer is particularly used for the anti-anxiety activity in the animals, in the uh, small animals like rat, mice, these all the animals we use to check the anti-anxiety activity of animals specifically. So what we used to do in this particular experiment, firstly we used to turn on in this particular equipment or apparatus. When you turn on it, as you can see, there are some uh, photocells and IR radiations are coming out from these. So what we will do, we will firstly divide the animal into two groups and we will weigh the animals and then number the animals one by one. Right. So one uh, group will be given as a control animal and another group will be given as a test animals. So what we used to do with the control animals, what we will do, we will place the animal after numbering and weighing one by one into the cages on the creep floor as you can see. So what we will do, as we put the animal on the grid floor, and the animal will start moving inside the apparatus. So as it crosses the photocells, and the light is coming, which is IR light, which is coming out from these photocells, so as it is crossing the light, then <coughs> this crossing number of crossing will be reflected on the meter, as you can see. This is what I am doing with the hand, as you can see. As I am moving my hand inside the photocells, in front of photocells, on the grid floor, this is reflected as a number of count on the meter, right? So what happens basically, if the animal is anxious, so once you place the animal, animal will start moving quickly and more number of crossings will be there, that reflects animal is in the anxiety state, right? So this is what we do in the control group animals. So we can use control and test same or we can divide it into the two groups also. So in the second phase of this particular apparatus experiment, what we will do, we will inject the test compound, anti-anxiety compound, it could be diazepam, nalazepam or anything else, right. So once you inject this, then you have to wait for 30 minutes, after injection of that particular compound, after waiting for 30 minutes, what you do, again you will repeat the same thing as you have done already done in the control animals. So once you place the animal again of test group, then again animal will start moving inside on the grid floor and it will start uh, crossing the photocells. And that number of crossing will be again reflected on the meter, as you can see. This is already done by me in the test sample or in the control samples. So what we will see, after injection of anti-anxiety compound, then number of crossings will be reduced because it is showing the anti-anxiety activity and the animals will be calmed down and it will be showing the less movement inside the cage, less movement on the grid floor. Then finally, what we used to do, we will calculate the percentage decrease in locomotor activity or you can say anti-anxiety activity by just calculating the uh, number of crossings on the uh, my, uh, control minus test upon 100. So this is how we used to perform the experiment on ectophotometer apparatus. Thank you very much.